I'm Tia Ewing. Shocking new video obtained by Fox 32 Chicago shows the moments an alleged drunk driver blew through a red light in Hoffman Estates, causing a fatal crash that killed two teens that had just graduated from Schomburg High School. Multiple traffic cameras were rolling. You see it at the intersection of Higgins Road and Barrington Road earlier this month. You see cars sitting at a red light, and that's when an SUV came blowing through. 18-year-old Amelia Mazikas and Deshaun Tudela were both killed on their way to work. The driver of the truck, 32-year-old Denny Rubio, was charged with five felonies, including aggravated DUI leading to death, reckless homicide, and attempt to disarm a peace officer. Body camera footage you see here captured police trying to take him into custody after his vehicle left the roadway, plowing right into a wooded area. Sir, step out here. Nah. Come on, it's okay. It's okay. No, hey, no. No, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. Hey, hey. Well, according to prosecutors, it took nine police officers to then subdue Rubio. After the crash, one of the officers finally used a stun gun to take Rubio into custody. Police say Rubio had a blood alcohol content nearly twice the legal limit and was carrying crack cocaine in his pocket. Rubio has a $2 million bail. He's due back in court July 7th. Anthony? All right.